There's the airplane. Oh, he's coming down. Touchdown. Nope. And there he goes. Perfect. Well done. <laughs> oh, they are taking the pilot away. That's good. They're going to put him in the back of the van. <laughs> and away he goes. <laughs> I spoke too soon. Got a lot of officers chasing him, this guy. Oh, the doorbells are so loud in this place. That's it, mate. <laughs> That's it. They're spinning it round. We're on our way to a aircraft that's making an emergency landing. This is by Urban Callouts. We haven't played this one before, so it sounds really, really interesting. We're on our way to see if we can lend assistance. Now, the police have apparently blocked off all of the the roads leading up to where it's going to be landing. I think it's got engine trouble. And it's going to be landing on this section of road, but a bit further up. Now, I don't often say this, but let's see if we can get this one to 30 likes, if possible. It won't hurt, trust me. <laughs> I don't often mention the likes, but let's see if we can get this one to 30. That'd be really awesome. Uh, we're out in the BMW marked estate here. Now, this is by Hunter for Blue Line Workshop. How cool does this car look? Really, really sweet indeed. Absolutely love it. Uh, link to Hunter's Discord is within the description below. So we're now approaching where the aircraft is. Uh, I think it's just above us. And uh, there we go. Okay, so crew count is one. So I'm guessing just the pilot. <laughs> well, it could just be a passenger. I don't know. Uh, the engine needs. Uh, a fire to be extinguished there we go there's the aircraft it's up there uh, we can go ahead and press i and that should change the camera angle although it is oh that's really cool that is very clever so it's going to be making an emergency landing just up i'm guessing just after the tunnel here oh, that is really sweet so we are in the tunnel i'm surprised it didn't crash so, oh, there's the roadblock. Roadblock's now coming down. There's the airplane. Oh, he's coming down. Touchdown. Oh, that was dodgy. Oh, oh no. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, control from Tango Mike 11. Uh, aircraft has touched down. Unfortunately, exploded. <laughs> that was that was not a good. Damn, that wasn't good. Looks like we've got ambulance on scene. The aircraft has exploded. There's the other roadblock up there. Oh man, that was not good. Uh, yeah, control from Tango Mike 11. Can we go ahead and roll uh, fire brigade to this location? And we can get air ambulance here as well. Uh, so let's do that. Oh man, let's get fire down here. I'm gonna get a air ambulance as well. Let's get them to land over this side. Uh, we can put out some flares as well. Let's get some flares down. Mark off the area here. Oh, there's the fire engine. Oh, I love these flares. Why is, why is everyone screaming? We've got ambulance on scene. We've got fire on scene. I don't know where the pilot is. He's in there somewhere. Air ambulance is now arriving as well. Where? What? I don't know where the pilot went. Oh, there he is. <laughs> it just appeared out of nowhere. Air ambulance is now landing. Good job, buddy. Fire service, I think, has finished. He's over here, gents. Just over here. They're not interested one bit, are they? Right, Natasha's dealing with this guy. Fire crew, please don't run over him. I think they're just gonna stay like that. Nope. And there he goes. Perfect. Well done. <laughs> but you made it very difficult to treat now. You are aware of that, aren't you? <laughs> I don't know what he's doing. How am I meant to get to him now? Can we drag his legs? I'm not too sure. Not sure how we treat this man. We, we did have an ambulance down here, but I don't know where he's gone. You're kind of in the way. What do we move out of the way? You're on top of the pilot here. Let's drag him out of the way. There we go. 
Let's move them backwards. Uh, let's go round. Oh, it's heavy. Let's go round this way. That's it, mate. <laughs> That's it. I'm spinning it round. <laughs> I'm spinning the airplane round. Oh, dear. Oh, and then away he goes. All right, so we're going to have to tend to this guy ourselves. Uh, air ambulance. Where's the air? The air ambulance has just disappeared. Let's get the instant support oh, yeah. unit down here. That'd be pretty good. Here it comes. It's now coming down the road. So this is a pretty major instant now. I don't know how we go about removing... Oh, he's all right. Treatment successful. Uh, we better call a normal ambulance down here as well. Ambulance. Yeah, control from Tag Mike 11. Uh, we can get a ambulance down here. The uh, incident support vehicle has just arrived on scene. Uh, oh, he's... Uh, nope, they're just going to stare at him. <laughs> All right, well, ambulance is on scene regardless. Hopefully they can go ahead and treat this guy. Uh, no, they're just gonna... They're just not gonna do anything. Alright, okay. I think you're stuck here forever, mate. Oh, we can tow this away. Can we search this? Hmm, better not. Let's just get a tow truck down here for... Yeah, control from Tango Mike 11. Uh, fire crew have made the aircraft safe. Can we get towed down here for this vehicle, please? Oh, here they are. That didn't take long. Right, AA's on scene. Oh, this is going to be interesting. What? Whoa, it's slow down. Uh, call out corrupted. Oh, okay. Not too sure what happened there. Oh, they are taking the pilot away. That's good. They're going to put him in the back of the van. <laughs> All right. No, you can't you lose another one. That vehicle's always dirty. I don't... Oh, I think the police helicopter that was above us. That was... It's not looking good. That was one of the officers inside of the, the police helicopter. Uh, we better close off the roads down here. Uh, yes, let's close the roads, please. Treatment was no successful. Okay, this guy's gonna make it. Yeah, this guy, this vehicle always turns up dirty. Let me know if there's a way of adjusting that, please. Are oh, they gonna squeeze him in there as well? <laughs> All right. Well, at least we know we can get rid of people in using this vehicle. Uh, this vehicle you can find on UnionMods.com. There we go. He's in the back. Perfect. Don't <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where they've actually put them. Well done, Natasha. You've done very well. Uh, um, mind the car. Mind the pet. Oh, no, that's not good. Natasha, get out of the way quickly. You know. Oh, careful. And away he goes. Don't <laughs> I spoke too soon. Back a bit, mate. Simon! Come back, come back. Not too far. Oh, man. Oh, he's... No, he is going that way. Has he corrected himself? You just know full well he's going to slam that into reverse in a minute. And away he goes. Mission successful. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, control from Tango Mike 11. Uh... Uh, scene is now code 4. The aircraft has been removed. Pilot uh, has been treated and been taken away by ambulance. Oh, he has turned around. <laughs> did, after all of that, he did turn around and come back. Oh, what a guy. All right, on our way to a call. Uh, this is from Yobin Callout. So apparently a unstable patient has reportedly escaped from a uh, hospital. So we are going to be making our way to this location. Uh, it's about half a mile away. Uh, we haven't tried this one before. I think it's a new call-out from Yobin Callouts. Uh, looks like it's the hospital that's just over here. So we're going to go and see what's going on. See what this is all about. I do like trying out new call-outs. Always fun to do. Okay. Yeah, control from Tagamike 11 shows state 6 on scene. 
I think it's that lady over there. Alright, let's jump on out and see what's going on then. Now you get Natasha. So there's a security guard there. Okay, speak to the nurse. Alright. That's it, mate. You just... <laughs> just you, <laughs> of all the places you could stand to go on your mobile phone. Uh, hello, miss. Uh, Officer Tom, Metropolitan Police. Hey, officer. Over here. What? What do you mean, over here? <laughs> all right. All right, I'll come around this way. What? Oh, is it that person over there? No, I don't think it is. I think that's just some random person. Hang on, hang on lady. I'll be back in a second. What is this over here, then? The task is after someone. Yeah, control from Tango Mike 11. Just, uh... Be advised, we've got one suspect, I see one male, black top, jeans, running away. It's going to be Dorset Drive at the moment. Tried to use my car to block him just then. I don't know why he's running. Why is this guy running? He's blocking. No. Are we up, Natasha? Oh, there's another officer. Let's see if we can catch up. I'm going to head him off from the pass. I oh, just knocked over the bin. My driving is not very good. We'll have to run after him. <laughs> I'm all over the place. I don't know if he's related to the call out. He's running. What, what's with these people running so far? Stop right there. Officer with legs. I keep forgetting what the tackle button is. What is the tackle button? I can't remember. Stop right there, sir. You're under arrest. Oh, there we go. Stop what you doing? Oh, nice one, Natasha. She's got, the, got a taser out there. Oh, we've got one as well. What was her taser? Down on the ground, sir. I think I just bugged him out. Take him down. down on the ground, right now. Let me see those hands. Yeah, I just bugged him out. I can die. Oh, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Natasha. Let's get back to the, uh, the call, shall we? I think the problem was uh, he went to go and lie. He went to go and lie on the ground, uh, but because I used stop the pen at the same time, it then bugged him out. All right, we're back at the hospital now. <laughs> let's let's get back out again. Sorry, lady. Right, uh, what's going on? Are you guys okay? Well, I'm all right. Yeah, not too bad. But you called us. Uh, yeah, we're fine. But oh. It's Oh, that was... Okay. <laughs> yeah, we're fine. But we've got a big problem here. We just had a patient escaped who has known history of serious issues. They're saying something really concerning and threatening things before they escaped. Uh, do you know where they went? Uh, not got a clue. I want to find them as soon as possible for their own safety and everyone else's. Is there any information on the patient or a description? Uh, yes, I have some medical records right here. Thank you. Uh, take them. This will Shut explain their diagnosis up. too. So I think that's that's all the dialogue. Let's go and see if we can locate this person. And looks like there's a search area on the map. In you get Natasha. Let's head on round. Should have switched those lights off when at the hospital. Let's head on over and see if we can find this patient. I quite like driving in the snow. It's quite nice. Let us know in the uh, the comments what you think. Uh, should we do a few more episodes whilst snow is in the game? Or is it a bit too dark on the screen? I'm not too sure. Sorry, mate. I'm the police. I can do what I want. Okay. So the patient is around here somewhere. They didn't really give us a description on what they look like. So that, that doesn't, well, that doesn't really help us, really, does it? Ah, so it looks like we've found the individual. I was searching ages and ages for this person. I went underground and everything. <laughs> Looks like we finally found him. Yeah, control from Tiger Mike 11. Uh, Looks like we found the uh, escaped uh, person from hospital. They are currently on Dorset Drive, we're heading westbound. Uh, it's going to be IC3 male. It's going to be dark t-shirt and three quarter jeans. I do want to get out, Natasha, so we can stop right there, buddy. Right, hey, you get Natasha, get after the man. Let's get our tasers drawn. Officer Taser, stop what you're doing right now. Nope, he didn't listen one bit. After him, Natasha. See if we can get this guy. Whoa, careful, mate. 
got a lot of officers chasing him, this guy. This, <laughs> this is probably a deja view, this thing. So, wow, he is really quick, this man. Stop, buddy. Please stop. But he's running back towards him. No, oh, Natasha. Oh, that's my fault that time. He's super quick, this man. I might have to use my car to... They, they got him, they got him. Bad time as well. Stop right down, buddy. They're down on the ground. Officers with tasers. He's complying this time. Natasha is going in for the cuffs. Okay, so we finally got the man that we were after. Let's go ahead and put my taser away. Uh, those two officers are from the call out itself. So, this was the guy that we were after. Let's get a quick... Yeah, Jerry Brown. 20th of the 5th, 1996. Uh, let's just relay through that to the control. Uh, not actively wanted. Uh, but I'm going to need to go back to the hospital. Uh, they were there for their own safety. Uh, we will go ahead and pat this guy down. You got anything on you, sir, that you shouldn't have? Anything that's sharp? And if it's going to hurt me or you? It's got flip flops on. Uh, Jerry Brown, packing tape. A lollipop, we've got to love a lollipop. First one this year. <laughs> First lollipop this year. All right, okay. Uh, let's go ahead and we will get some transportation. For oh, that'd be pretty cool if we had to take him back to the hospital ourselves to finish the mission. That would pretty. That would be pretty cool. Uh, we go ahead and get an ambulance down here. And then they can go back to the hospital. I love the snow actually, it looks really nice. Uh, this jacket by the way, that we're wearing, and the radio is uh, from Blighty 3 d link is also in the description. Here's the ambulance, I'm pretty sure a officer, tra yeah there they are. So the officer goes with the guy if they've been handcuffed, that's a really cool feature there, I love that. Alright, where he goes Jerry, he's going to go in the back of the ambulance. I must update my ambulance. I like this one, but it doesn't say London on it, so I need to change it. It looks pretty cool, though. All right, away he goes, and uh, Steve, the policeman, is going to get in the back with him. We're on our way to a call regarding a landlord and tenant dispute. Uh, the landlord reports that the tenant is refusing to leave their property. Uh, I'd imagine this is a civil matter, but we've been asked to attend... Uh, just in case there's any breach of the peace. I'm guessing the tenant has been told that they have to leave. I'm hoping that they've been given their correct amount of notice time. And the landlord is a little bit upset that they haven't done so already. Uh, this looks like it's the property. There's the guy up there. Okay, I'm guessing that's the tenant, uh, the the, uh, the landlord. Yeah, control from Tiger Mike 11, show state six on scene, over. Right, you get Natasha. Let's go and see what's going on here then. It's quite a nice little uh, place up here. I think we had a call out over here before. Hello, nice, sir. Officer Tom, Metropolitan Police. How can we help? Uh, hey, officer. Appreciate you coming out so quick. That's all right. Uh, no worries. What's going on here? Uh, so I've got a tenant living here uh, who I've advised 30 days ago that they have to move out. Uh, they got very upset by this, but I have a legitimate reason and they've given me and given them enough time to uh, leave. Okie dokie. Uh, according to London law, <laughs> they have 30 days notice to leave, which has been received. Okay, have you been able to enter the house? Uh, no, officer. I have a key, but they've dead bolted the door from the inside. Okay, don't waste my time. Uh, Z, okay, I'll talk to the uh, X, I can't do that for you. So... Okay, so we can talk to the person uh, by pressing Z, or we can say, no, we're not going to help out. But I'm going to say, well, this, we can at least talk to the person and see what's going on. So let's press Z. Yeah, I understand. Let me see if I can do anything. Okay, so press Y to ring the doorbell. All right, okay. Oh, the doorbells are so loud in this place. Press Y to reason with the tenant. Okay. Hey, can you please open the door and come out here? It's just the police. It's just the police. It's, it's the police. Oh, it is the police. 
<laughs> I'm adding words in here. Uh, no, officer, I will not un be unlawfully evicted from my own property. All right, okay. Look, let's at least talk this through. Uh, let's not make this any harder than it has to be for anybody here. Okay, fine. Well, that person was easily convinced. But you better not arrest me or unlawfully search my property, officer. I would not be mistreated. This guy didn't need much uh, talking around, did he? <laughs> Please come out. I will not come out. Please come out. Okay, sir. <laughs> uh, anyway, back to the episode. Yeah, of course, just come out here and talk. Oh, wow. Well done, sir. <laughs> That's very... Whoa, 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 what's going on? What was he running for? Let's get my taser out. I don't know why he's running. The Tash is... Oh, the Tash is... Did he go to attack him? I think he just went to attack that guy. Yeah, control from Tiger Mike 11. Can we get uh, additional assistance to this location, please? Uh, we got a male that's running at the moment. I'm going to go ahead and get air support down here. Going to be uh, North Sheldon Avenue, heading westbound. Uh, oh, he's been hit, hit there. Officer Taser, I will use my taser. Stop what you're doing right now. Officer with taser. Stop what you're doing, pal. Stop right there. Hands up in the air. Down on the ground. I will use my taser against you. Down on the ground. Did the landlord try to attack the tenant just then? I must have missed it. Right, we've got Natasha running down towards... Natasha, did you leave the, the tenant by himself? I think she did. If we could do a super run. <laughs> Come on, sir. I like how my legs are going really, really quickly. And here's just sort of taking baby steps, so to speak. Anyway, was the tenant... Oh, the tenant has been arrested. Uh, right, just wait here then, sir, please. You wait there for me. I'm not going to know until later, until I look at the footage again. I have to check my body cam. Let's go ahead and just pat... Let's just pat the tenant down. I think he went to attack him, you know. So I pat the guy down. He's got a flashlight and a lighter on him. So nothing on him there. We get him taken away. We get him dealt with down at the police station, I think. I'm not 100% sure what uh, transport uh, two suspects. Uh, yeah, we just in one vehicle. Save on diesel. I'm not 100% sure what happened, to be honest. I can only assume that the landlord tried to attack the tenant here. Uh, we'll go ahead and search this guy down as well. Found some wire cutters and a few bits and pieces. Uh, Joss Fat, uh, he's not wanted. Let's do this guy as well. John Dom. <laughs> Dom Dom. Oh, he's actually outstanding. Oh, guys, he's going to be arrested for that then. I don't know what he's outstanding for. Uh, we can have a little look, actually. Whilst they get taken away. Oh, there's Susan. Oh, no, Sandra. That one's Sandra. Well done, Sandra. Uh, John Dom. So, he's wanted for burglary. <laughs> right? <laughs> so, oh, why would you call the police out when you know that you're actively wanted for an offence? And I probably shouldn't put them both in the same police car, but... Thanks. We might as well. I mean, it says on fuel, doesn't it? Uh, I thought I did recognise the car then. That's the one from uh, out of London. That we use up in uh, Sandy. Right. The, oh, Natasha! I think she's okay. <laughs> well done, Natasha. Oh, dear. What? How can you possibly be struggling to turn around? Do you have so much room? That's ridiculous. Well, I certainly hope you enjoyed today's episode. As always, it's been a lot of fun. Thank you so much for watching. If you can't wait till the next episode, just click on the left of the second, and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Till then, take care. Goodbye. <laughs>